the Miami Dolphins passed on upgrading at running back during the offseason. At first, it looked like that they were putting full faith into Miles Gaskin, but that has not been the case through the first three games. The Dolphins are trying something new this year by going with co-offensive coordinators in each game, and it has not gone well so far. It seems like they don't call the right plays, and one thing for sure is that they don't stick with the run game enough. Gaskin has had a good start to the season even though the stats don't back him up that much. As we expected, he has been efficient catching the ball in the chances he's had. Gaskin has seven catches for 51 yards. Sure, he is only averaging 4.8 yards per catch, but the more receptions he gets, the more that average will go up. History has shown for Gaskin that the more receptions he gets, the better. He really took off in 2020 when he had 41 receptions for 388 yards, two touchdowns, and averaged 9.5 yards per catch. In his whole career, he averages 8.3 yards per catch. The Dolphins need to realize how much they could really use Gaskin. As for rushing, he only has 27 rushes for 139 yards. The positive is that Gaskin is averaging 5.1 yards per carry, which is the best of his career so far. His 27 attempts ties him for 36th in the NFL hole his 5.1 yards per carry is 10th in the NFL. It just does not make sense for why the Dolphins are not committing to Gaskin in the run game more. He is clearly the best running back in the group, and he has not disappointed in the chances that he has had. In fact, Week 3 against the Raiders was the first time the Dolphins ran with him for more than 10 times in a game this year. He ran 13 times for 65 yards which is very good for him. Even rushing with him 13 times is not enough. But it is much better than only giving him 9 carries against the Patriots and 5 carries against the Bills. Gaskin is not a bad running back at all. While Tua is out, it is important to lean more on the run game and Gaskin should be getting close to 20 carries on Sunday against a beat-up Colts team.